Come on, it's Czechoslovakia. We zip in. We pick him up. We zip right out again. We're not going to Moscow. It's Czechoslovakia. It's like going into Wisconsin. Well, I got this shit kicked out of me in Wisconsin once. Forget it. Hey guys, it's Viper GTS, and I was going to film outside today, but the weather is not holding up. It's kind of on off rain. So, came inside, got to check out this uh, IMRE. It's from Trek Republic. It is the civilian version of their BDP ration. A lot of the items are going to be the same as the military version, but this one does have some commercially available items. This one's menu number four, and it just expired about a week or two ago, March 23rd of 2022. Here's everything out of the box. Up top, there's a couple packs of crisp bread graham. And then over to the drinks, two coffees, two teas, a mandarin drink, and some chewing gum. And then for the crackers, we've got three types of jam, strawberry, cherry, and peach. Um, two unmarked bars, but they sure feel like chocolate, so I'm guessing that's what they are. Um, three wet naps with napkins, two packs of salt, two multivitamins, eight packs of sugar, that's quite a bit. And then for the canned items, there is beef in its own juice, pork and garlic sauce, chicken pate, and this one kind of translates into pork or creamy pork, so also says pork with mayonnaise, so some type of pork luncheon meat. Let's get something out for breakfast. I'm not all that sure what's supposed to be for breakfast, so this is what I picked. Start off with some coffee. Pack of sugar, and then also some tea. And then a pack of sugar in that one as well. And I went with the cherry jam. These are sticky, but I didn't find any that were leaking, so I'm not too sure. And the chicken, or sorry, this one is the uh, pork luncheon meat. Coffee and tea are all set. And these crackers are excellent. They're light, crispy. Let's try it out with some of that cherry jam. Great natural flavor. Perfect. Now this pork luncheon meat it smells just fine, just like you expect it to. Very thick, but looks nice and smooth. Kind of plain, bland. Salt looks perfect though. Not too bad, but not my first choice. Well, I'm gonna change my mind about this. It has a real weird aftertaste. I think it tastes like it's supposed to, but I just don't like it. So let's go with another jam. Try out this peach. Oh yeah, great flavor. Check out the coffee. It's all right, it took a lot to dissolve though. The crystals were really big and they actually stuck to the spoon. And your tea is just a normal orange pico. All right, let's grab some lunch. It's been a couple hours, and for lunch, we're going to go with that beef and its own juices. Try that chicken pate. Have some of this mandarin drink. And I saved some of the crackers from lunch. And then we're going to finish it up with uh, some chocolate at the end there. Looking a bit chunky. Hopefully this one is a little bit better than that pork one. It looks about the same. Then I'm thinking about possibly getting this on some heat. But let's take a look before we do that. Yep, lots of nice fat on there, so I'm going to heat this up a little bit. It was pretty much one big chunk, but I sliced it up a bit with the spoon. So let's see how this is when it's hot. 
there are a lot of people that like this, so I don't mean to be insulting, but this really smells a whole lot more like uh, like this. Let's hope it tastes better. Mm, not really. It's better than the last one, though. This one I can actually eat. The last one had that, that aftertaste to it that I just couldn't deal with, but this isn't that bad. The drink stirred up nice. Light mandarin flavor. Pretty decent. The beef is nice and heated up, so let's get this out. Quite a lot of liquid in there. Very soft meat. Smells okay. Yeah, see, that's really good. I don't mind this one at all. It's, um, tastes just like beef, of course, you know. Nice salt. A little bit of onion flavor to it. Flavor's pretty good. Let's try it on the cracker. Oh yeah, that's great. Flavor's awesome. So far, this one is by far my favorite. Alright, let's check out that chocolate. See, the package is pretty much unmarked. There's some words on here, but they're all faded off. Okay, nice dark chocolate bar. Good quality. And this must be a chewable because the size of it, nobody's swallowing that, so. Hmm. Nice citrusy flavor. Probably good for you too. That's gonna wrap up lunch. See you in a couple hours. Alright, dinner time. So we're gonna go with the pork with garlic sauce. Uh, some more of the crackers. For a dessert, it's going to be some gum, jam, and the chocolate. And made another tea. And I wanted you guys to see this, the uh, coffee itself. How different these crystals are compared to most. That's why it doesn't dissolve very well. These are extremely dark. Flavor is good though, but it doesn't really dissolve all that well. So let's get this on some heat, but we'll take a look first. Wow. Does not look appealing. Smells good though. Let's see. Yep, not even close. And for comparison, here's another check ration. This one expired 2019. It's made up of these four cans, all have an initial on them, and it corresponds to the menu written here. It is chicken lunch meat, liver pate, one labeled just pork, and one labeled just beef. Something tells me I probably won't like this. Okay, our main is nice and hot. And this is a big 400 gram can. Looks a little better than before. Lots of sauce. Pleasant smell. And there actually are some chunks in there like the picture. The smell of the garlic is definitely overpowering. In a good way. Let's give it a taste. It has about the same texture as the pâtés did. Good flavor. Nice black pepper flavor. Lots and lots of garlic. So they weren't lying about that part. Let's try it with a little crunch. And the amount of sauce you get is, is pretty insane. That's the way to go. Another cup of tea and coffee. I used hotter water this time and it definitely dissolved a lot better. Delicious. It doesn't need salt, that's right on. A little extra black pepper would be nice. But the texture is really soft, but the flavor is its pretty amazing. Um, this is really the best one out of all of them. 
So dinner was really filling. I'm going to finish it up off camera. Chocolate was really good though. Going to have that for dessert. Check out the strawberry jam. Seedless for the most part. Let's try this. All right, pretty good. I opened up the gum and it said liquid filled. And it sure is. There's like a, a drop of mint liquid in there. So pretty good. So thanks for watching, guys. This was IMRE from Czech Republic. See you on the next one.